The most common symptom that women experience during menopause is hot flashes. Almost 80% of us will have hot flashes at one point or another. For some women, they're mild, they're not disruptive, and they go on with their day-to-day -day life. For other women, they're impaired by their symptoms and can't function. Well, no matter what stage you are in menopause, the reality is there's something called a hot flash. And you know what? It comes every woman's way. Whether you want to walk along holding a little hand fan, that's an option. But we're going to talk today about actually how to dress to deal with that, right from the foundation pieces all the way through. So what you really want to start with in the foundation pieces are your bra and panty. And absolutely, I recommend highly cotton. Cotton is a great fabric, it breathes, it's going to be able to deal with those hot flashes. And you don't want anything in a bra that is too padded, adding again more density, therefore closer to the skin, and, and really creating even more heat. It's great when you get an underwire and you make sure that it's really covered with the cotton. And really, any cotton should be at least 90%. And if you add a little synthetic so that it doesn't gape and you get the stretch you need, that's totally okay. Especially in the panty, you want to make sure that the gusset is cotton as well and it has lots of give and everything is comfortable and has an ease about it. So this is really about function meeting fashion. You want to look your very best, but at the same time you want to be comfortable through the hot flashes. I think this top is a perfect example of something that works. It's 100% cotton. It has a very nice open weave about it. It has an openness through the bottom of the top, if you'll notice. But notice how there's still structure. It sits so beautifully on the shoulders. You don't feel like you're in a big loose bag. You still feel very beautiful in the way that it fits through the sleeve, but it breathes. What if this is all about really at the end of the day? is natural fabrics because they're the ones that you really want to go for. Whether they're linen as you see in this top, whether they're bamboo, whether they're cotton, they could have a little bit of synthetic. Preferably 90% natural, maybe 10% synthetic so it doesn't bag. But look at the openness of this, the open natural weave, and again, the ability to absorb moisture. That is the name of the game. So here we are with Carolyn, and Carolyn is wearing one of these beautiful suits that I pulled, which is a great example of something that you could be really comfortable in, dealing with hot flashes as we are, as well as a gorgeous cotton shirt. It's a very refined, thin cotton, and that's what you're looking for. And you're looking for something, especially in the pant, that's got some room in the leg. You don't want anything that is too confined or too tight against your body. And fortunately, the wider leg pant is very popular right now. Here's another example of something that uh, has shown how wool has come so far and how lightweight that it can really be. When you actually look at the sleeves, there's, you can almost see through the wool. It is so beautiful and sheer, actually, almost. And finally, I loved this poncho. Coats can be a real problem because they really are there to keep you warm. And sometimes that's just not what you need. And if you're in a big parka, you might as well just jump in a pool because that's how wet you're going to be. So this poncho or shawl collared kind of coat is a great option. You'll always look elegant and nice, whether over a dress or suit. And on top of it, you know what, you're going to be very comfortable. What you wear at night is very important because getting your sleep is everything to being able to really, you know, manage what's going on with the physical changes in your body. So here I have a really great top that I picked out. Again, it's nice and loose. It's got ease away from the body. It's cotton. It's going to be able to breathe nicely. I loved also what's happening on the sleeve. There's a lace detail, but again, it's allowing air to get through and close to your body so that it's going to cool you down. And this is the kind of piece that you're going to look for, and you'll be a lot more comfortable comfortable sleeping at night. It also has a wonderful pant. Look at how nice and loose away from the body this is. That's what you want. Just remember, there's lots of options out there. You can still look fashionable and beautiful, even though you may be going through menopause, and there's different changes that are happening to your body. There are lots of treatment options for women during menopause. One of the most important things, though, is to remember that each woman is different and may experience menopause in a different way. 
and women need to talk to their primary care provider, their family doctor, to understand what are the best options for them. One of the choices is hormone therapy. There are non-hormonal options. It depends what the woman's symptoms really are all about.